Hello, boys and girls. My name is Hotel C and welcome back to Oxygen Not Included. Last time we re or we changed the setup of our power uh, generation uh, so that was a bit of uh, uh, microchips uh, we can get out a bit more. What needs to be done? We also want the same for the hydrogen generators so i guess what we will start here is uh mopping this up a bit uh, extend the ladder up here and maybe have a bit of a hole there just to collect all the liquids and then Go over here, have a door there, um, and then on this side, That's that's part of the thing that we want to do. We also have shovel farm here. Um, we want to collect the iron on top of here. So for that to work efficiently, we should have. Uh, bunker doors here that we can open and close um, and uh, then we can basically let the, re or the uh, everything on top fall down and harvest it um, however we also should consider that we need to somehow control the the doors and we do that with uh, the uh, the sensors here and for optimal resolution we need two sensors and we can stack the, those on top of each other as long as they are not too close so I guess what we will do here first is maybe make a bit of, of room here. Um, we will need quite a bit of steel, so that's not enough. And the reason why we do not have uh, steel is we are lacking lime. So what do we do if we want to get lime we go down here and look for a spot that has some uh, for example we can dig through here and collect that also have here in the floor we can collect and that should help us and I think uh, our duplicants they have enough to do for now um, so let's uh, let them do their work 
And in the meantime, I can figure out um, what I still need to do uh, to make this uh, setup on top actually work as planned. Uh, and here we, of course, will copy the same settings. Um, and that will be good. Um, we then also need uh, to not have a snake line. Uh, we can go up here and then we do not need to have uh, a bridge in there. Right, so be right back. This setup here is not entirely complete and we are running a bit low on energy. That's why I expanded here with a force coal generator. It's a bit an uh, awkward uh, setup because it needs to be one higher, but it works. And uh, what I also had to do in order to save a bit of uh, power is turn these pumps off up here, meaning that the uh, aqua tuner, which use quite a bit of power, are not running um, and we can see. But I did mark out the uh, space where we want to have the first uh, space scanner. So maybe uh, let's place that uh, on here. And then basically I think 16 blocks below we can have the second one. Uh, well, let's actually make that here. Um, that's a nice spot. And then we shall have this over here. Of course, we need uh, power going over uh, to these two scanners. We need to dig this out because they have to have a rather open view to the sky. Uh, we have to ensure that we replace this with bunker doors and we have to come up with uh, something um, that allows us to uh, basically uh, get rid of anything that comes from below. And the way we do that is by having a layer here and then on here we can place a Robo Miner and then we will need another one here. Is that correct? Uh, actually one over. So that this one can mine everything that lands here on top. And then we will have the second one here. And we need to cool these things uh, because they can get a bit warm. And in order to do that, we need drop of liquid on here uh, but so that that does not evaporate uh, we need a 
back more there and where is that so it was in here drywall it is called or is it in here in here so we will have a bit of drywall there um, then we will break these ladders because there we will place a bottle emptier so we can drop a bit of liquid down there and that should work out pretty well from the calories we have, I think we can think about adding another duplicate, especially one that has the traits research and suit wearing, because then we can over time develop them to an astronaut and uh, get payback who is currently in the rocket. However, a pop wall is also very good because uh, we do have a farm here but we do not have um, uh, any shelf walls in there so where did it go Bowl pop. Now let's make sure that we have the bowl pop selected here as well. And that should basically secure our uh, um, secure our uh, food supplies needs uh, whatever. Uh, this geyser this vent became active again uh, but we did not manage to finish this part off and up here also not much progress has been made also that the tank is now almost full so we will see if that will be enough to reach the next outer um, destination um, we do need 829 but at least petroleum we have way more in here uh, so maybe we uh, uh, we have to compensate there a bit for that we will see and I let in a bit of uh, uh, power up here but only to down there and we will see how we uh, manage because I think uh, here we can still have a few robo miners on this one but for the doors we will need this wire here and uh, Probably we will have something like a battery transformer set up over here that needs eventually some cooling, I would guess. But all in good time. As it stands, we made some progress, had some batteries in here, some transformers up there. Um, also connected or planned to connect one of the wires um, have some cooling set of plant here that we actually can connect uh, we still need uh, to to finish the, the, the power wiring there 
Uh, we are progressing and I think next episode we can think about getting this done, getting that done, because down here we are looking good power wise. We get currently hydrogen, we get natural gas, we are pumping oil to uh, generate petroleum. So, at least for the moment, everything is good. We also could progress uh, our research. So, currently, we only have two left. Uh, which are not really essential for this playthrough uh, because we have the, the, the cargo bay research and on here I added two uh, incubators and another farm for poke shells because having them sit down there with eggs well, that's just a bit hazardous so um, we will see how we will manage that, uh, but all the more progress. We'll have to wait for the next episode, so don't forget to subscribe if you are not already. And I will see you for sure next time. Until then, goodbye.